Good morning, students. I'm going to show you a demo on how to do a quill.org activity. First, um, after you've logged in, you'll see a menu of options. I'm not a student account, so I don't have that. Go ahead and pick the first exercise there, and then it'll likely bring you to a window that looks like this. The directions may differ slightly, so you see directions here. Um, please remember to read them. Let me read these ones out loud for you. Welcome to Quill Connect. Combine the sentences together into one sentence. You may add or remove words. You do want to keep it as accurate and close to the original as possible. There's often more than one correct answer, and they'll let you know what the other correct answers are afterwards. Remember to use correct spelling, capitalization, and punctuation. All right, let's begin. Combining actions, people, and things. So usually Quill will then give you a big little mini lesson, big mini lesson on how to do what it's going to ask you to do. So in this case, we're going to be combining actions, people, and things. So we've got two subjects. Subjects are kind of who's doing stuff in the sentence. So we're going to combine jellyfish and seahorses to show that they do the same thing. They both swim. So what we're going to see is jellyfish swim in the ocean, seahorses swim in the ocean, and then we're going to write jellyfish and seahorses swim in the ocean. Then they can reverse it to make it two objects, read that, two actions, read that. All right, let's start lesson. Superheroes protect people. Superheroes protect cities. We're going to combine this into one. Most simple way to do that is superheroes, because that's the same in both sentences. Protect people and cities. And, oops, cities. Now, as you do this, you want to make sure that you use correct capitalization, punctuation, and again, capitalization, just because I was being dramatic. Don't be dramatic as you enter this in. Um, you also want correct spelling. Yay! All right, let's do another one. So here's where it tells us the other answers. Hmm. All right, let's see what happens if we do a wrong answer. Spider-Man can climb buildings and Spider-Man... Oh, I'm gonna leave that. Can make spider webs. <laughs> oh, it's telling me to revise my work. Use the hint as an example of how to make your sentence shorter and more concise. Concise is getting to the point quickly. So down here there's a hint. On the same person or thing, does two actions combine the actions with and, or, but, or so? No comma needed. Fine. Spider-Man can climb buildings and make spitter webs. Ooh, it doesn't like my spelling. Oh, and it highlighted that for me. Hey guys, that's actually a new feature. You guys are so lucky. <sighs> well. And now we're done. So you'll move through these more quickly if you can be more correct the first time. If you need to correct things, that's fine. It'll That's the practice you need then. But if you can do it correctly, I'll be done faster. All right, so if I wanted to continue, I would get all the way to the end. Um, let's actually do that.